Hello guys and hope doing well. This is the AD624 operational amplifier to check ECG frequencies and this is the schematic to uh, make project for ECG frequency uh, driver. This um, IC is much better than INA versions ICs because of it's coming with uh, different um, gates and gain of the inputs you can see that here I uh, try to loop the uh, 200 300 and 600 um, gain of the amplifier if you download the um data sheet of this um i see you are able to know exactly what we can do with the gains and how we are able to use the gain of the i see you can see pin 3 11 13 12 and 16 are connected to each other because of we don't have a special micros to control the gain of the i see and also you can see we have three um sensor input this is my sensor is very cheap and easy to find and i used this hand gel as a connection gel by this gel hands you're able to have something like 100 kilo ohm resistance and without the gel you should go more than one mega ohm resistance and the result should not be good without the gel and even you're going to the hospital you can see when they are taking the um, hairs or a nerve or uh, mind drawer graft drawers you can see that they are using these um, sensors or using the suction version uh, but uh, you are also use the wires only the copper wires only if you don't have these sensors but it's very e easy to order online ad 624 ad is a gold version the up the, the ground is connected to this gold um, face here and over to uh, 4.47 kilo ohm resistor uh, you will make safety for the connection. I did not use the diodes for um, protecting and remove the noise from the AD 80, 80, uh, 80 624. You can see that we have four connected diodes. Uh, to uh, to uh, to and 41 48 is very good but if you need uh, the good result it would be better to use the diodes germanium diodes and order the germanium diodes online i'm looking to show you exactly what kind of diodes will help to have the exact result for the AD uh, 624 however so after this the output should be pin 9 pin 9 and 10 also connected to each other you can see that I do the same and don't forget do not use the big um, capacitors as ceramic one the capacitors like this is not comfortable is not compatible with this project you need the ceramic one like this and maximum 25 volt and the resistors should not be more than uh, half watt because of uh, this um, project need is very sensitive and we need um, more sensitivity and if we use the big uh, version of com electronic components it's very very hard to uh, check the 
output of uh, ECG and the output of ECGs tolerance going to uh, one percent or and maximum ten percent of uh, each world and in uh, each um, sequence you need very sensitivity so so this kind of diodes if you find is very good but this is the old version and big one if you don't have it you should go to the to uh, 1 and 48 45 like this very cheap and easy to find it and finally some germanium diodes like this with white lines uh, red lines would help you exactly to um, check the to uh, isolate the uh, input um, voltage coming from the skin and also with the galvanometers the guys using this kind of diodes to protect the um, ECG meter. So I can use uh, one um, project is a real ECG meter, and uh, sometimes the guy is using this ECG meter as um, projects like uh, electronic massagers with the sensors. They will transfer uh, thousand volts with small budget of um, current to the body and it will shake the some place uh, 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 in, in your body and you are able to exactly feel the voltage and is not dangerous so this is a real one and this is the diodes that the project used and this is full version of the project So I'm going to connect to the project to the Arduino and will make one video for programming and is good enough to write down the project analog input and draw the serial plotter. This is my code, it's very simple. The my input is analog pin number zero. The output we need the big uh, we, we need high speed serial output. I set 115, 115 200 for the output. This is the very good speed for output. And finally, I'm writing the output to the serial port by six digits and the 550 milli seconds delay is good enough for this project and finally we are using the uh, serial plotter this one to draw exactly the ecg i will wait i will make one more video to check exactly what's going on thanks for watching this project and goodbye